Now, what is the source of this energy? Yes, what do you think can be the source of energy? Once again, very obvious source of energy is food. The plants, green plants especially, they can make their own food, but the heterotrophs including human beings which depend on an external source of food, they cannot make their own food. They obtain food from other sources. This act of obtaining food, what is this called? This is called nutrition. Another point is that the living cells, they mainly require carbon because carbon is part of every organic compound and the living cell is made up of organic compounds. Now from where will this carbon come? Obviously from again food. That is why you know that food has various nutrients. Now these nutrients are carbohydrates, fats, proteins, all of them provide carbon molecules. But does by just having carbon molecules in the form of carbohydrate, fat or protein, we can get energy? No, it will not. So, in addition to food, we will require something more, which on burning food will be able to release energy. What is this something else? This something else is oxygen. When cellular respiration takes place, there is biooxidation. This is called a biooxidation process. So, food is burnt in the presence of oxygen and this is called, this is called cellular respiration and it is a kind of bio oxidation. 